Welcome to the Abandoned Raider Base Part 2. If you haven't watched Part 1, there's a few things that you need to know. Number 1, this building has been abandoned for more than 60 years. Number 2, there's a handful of missing people cases and we believe that they're linked to this building. Number 3, back in the 1980s, many people would see biker gangs going into the building with large black duffel bags, but when they would leave, they would leave with nothing. We believe that the bags have been placed in the underwater level, so today we brought our friend Matt, who is a professional diver, to search these spots. I even brought a fishing magnet to see if we could snag anything cool and hidden at the bottom. Now this is where we started having issues. The water levels were way lower than the last time and there was a bunch of objects that were very sharp and pointy protruding from the water. This is when our friend Matt told us that he would not be able to do the dive as it was too dangerous. On top of that, Matt dropped my brand new fishing magnet into the water, sat and depressed, I worked my way down, walked along the sketchy beams until I reached the area where the magnet was lost. I was unable to find the magnet but I did find something way cooler. We discovered a spot that we never knew existed. A door that leads to unexplored rooms where we might possibly find the bags. Stay tuned for part 3.